And whenever you're ready. I've been ready. Name one time you were ready. Right now. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So I think I'm going to try saying the C word less on the podcast. Okay, why? Well, I think it's better for, like, I need to be media trained. Okay. In general. Right. Um, you need to, uh, well, nope, never mind. What? Be taken out? <laughs> I have the pee pads. <laughs> it helps me with my work. I get a lot more done. Yeah. 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 Right. I just piss on the floor like a little untrained yeah. pet. Right. Right. Yeah. Cunt. Tell three friends about the podcast and sound off in the trough below, you little content-loving hog. Rolling around in the pig pen. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> we're back. And we're back. Thank you so much for back. a quick word from our sponsors. Um, inedible bouquet. <laughs> you can't. It's just a normal bouquet. No, there's fruit in it. Inedible fruit. Inedible fruit, yeah. Not for a lack of trying. Wax? No. Ooh, okay. Maybe. Wax on, secrets. Wax on. <laughs> I have fruity little secrets. If you oh. want to know, you have to ask. But you have to ask again. <laughs> you have to follow up. You can't just give up right away. Right. Mm -hmm. Ask interrogatively. You haven't you haven't given me an answer that I found funny or right. I didn't know yet. That part. So I'm like, no, it's not wax. Because I don't want it. Whatever your first one is, no. This is a little backstage humor for the girls. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fish sticks. <laughs> well, why did you say fish sticks? And I said what I said. I <laughs> Thank you. I'm, my brain's going, is this like a deep cut South Park <laughs> reference? Is this, and I'm like, it's just fish sticks. It's just man. fish sticks, baby. No. <sighs> Bitch, I wish, it, I wish a fish stick would. I, that part. Right? Do you like fish sticks? I do, yeah. Does your mom know you like fish sticks? <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, fish sticks are pretty good, though. No, stop it. I'm not joking, bitch. No, not that one. <laughs> but I'm Ooh. not. No, not that one. Oh. This isn't the same as my stream deck. The buttons are out of order. You put them in that order. No, I know, and I put them, and I acclimated them on my own. Right. I, I'm upset that there's a miscongruence, and there's no one to blame except me. Right. Uh huh. That took you. That's that was good. I didn't know error was second from the left. You put it there. You left it there. Did I put it there? I have not touched any of these. You did this. I don't. I think that that's not true. I distinctly remember us doing it. You did it. I was there. You were part of it. You helped. I give you credit. I write your name on the paper. I didn't pick where they went. Do you want to? No. <laughs> well, I don't. <laughs> well, part of it's like. Part of it. Uh, see, Shocked we don't have that as a, as a button. <sighs> Honestly. Yeah. Well, like, I think we're just at a bad angle for it. Because, like, it's it, it, the, the angle that I do get to see it at is where they kind of bleed into the bottom because right. I'm kind of looking at it. Yeah. Um, I mean, at least that one's adjustable. This one's just like bodied out. I mean, yours could be adjustable. It's not, though. Oh. But like, it's not, though. It isn't. But like, it's not, though. That's peculiar. Anyway, we're working on the set. Hi. Not, not the new set. Hello. Yeah. Not we, do, we do need to work on the new set, actually. T. Yeah. 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 Do you want to hang out? Thank you. Yeah, I didn't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Understood. <laughs> I'll get to I'll get right to work on it, sir. Mm -hmm. Oh, actually I have been moving stuff from like little by little. You'd be surprised. I realized that I could put stuff in in the new podcast set lease to be determined. Um, right. Yeah, we're looking at the four seasons right now. Um that was a that was a Rudy Giuliani reference. In in memoriam of our late manager. Oh. So. I think.
think I found a Jamie. Okay. By the way. Uh huh. Someone to pull that shit up for us when we need it. Uh huh. Mm hmm. It's not me. Okay. It's not you neither. Okay. All right. We'll see. Okay. Fucking piss me off, dude. <laughs> <laughs> well, how am I supposed to? I can't be funny. You can give me not. Well, you're giving me everything right now. I gave you fish sticks. You did, I, and I really dropped the ball with fish sticks. I also gave you cunt. Yeah, you did. You you, you did. You gave me um cunt. So thanks. Yeah. I just was. I'm not here bodied, and you're just giving me nothing. Well, I I I came on here being like, <laughs> I'm gonna try to be good today. Why? Boring flop of. You're right. Ugh. Oh. Because I shouldn't have, oh. honestly. Oh. If I really wanted to like run the gambit, I like wouldn't have at all. I'm right here, stop yelling at me. <laughs> Who is it? Ring. I believe it's delivery. Actually, I happen to know that it's a delivery. It could be DiGiorno. If only it was a delivery. You know what I would do for DiGiorno pizza right here, right now. Oh, that sounds so good. You know what sounds better. What what sounds better? Fish sticks. Fish sticks. Actually, that my mom knows about. <laughs> Actually, I don't know the fish stick sounds better, but like the pizza that's like not. Listen, I fucking love frozen pizza, so don't get that twisted. Don't get it. I, 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 I'm not joking, joking bitch. bitch. That part. Mm -hmm. So don't get that twisted all up around. We got to get more drag sounds. But, by the way, but right this second, mm -hmm. a non-frozen pizza pizza would fuck pretty hard. You know what p pissed me off was when it could be literally anything. Name one thing that's upset me ever. Me. Earlier, just just a just moment ago, captured on camera mere seconds earlier. We have hundreds of hours of footage of me being upset with you. That's correct. And me being upset with me. <laughs> that's also correct. Do you know how how much footage is there of on the internet of you crying? Because I bet I got you beat. I don't think I don't know that there's any. Oh. So your cries were fake in your audios. Okay. Well, I didn't film them on camera because I don't need attention. You filmed them on what? Eight millimeter? <laughs> Just audio bit. <laughs> it's still film. Well. It's not filming because it's literally not film. By the laws set by Webster <laughs> and Miriam. Yeah. Fine. Miriam's got some explaining to do. Mm -hmm. Why does Webster get like all of like the heat? Webster's when dictionary. It's, when it's Miriam Webster, uh, I don't know. I wonder if they were two people, or if they were one person with a hyphenated last name, and then and then they got divorced because of the words. I believe it was two people. Really? But also, I simply couldn't be bothered to look it up. Yeah, I have a phone. I won't use it. No, not on camera. Not You're on being I, good. I can't. Cunt. Don't call me a <laughs> I didn't call you when I just said it. Well, you didn't, you didn't have enough of a you didn't have enough of a pause. You gave me a little. Hey, stinky! You keep acting up. I'm gonna. <laughs> no, my channel got demonetized. We can't get this one demonetized. That's why I was too. trying to be good. Why? Because well, Sin told me about it before I left. Yeah. They were like, "Oh, did you like?" I was like, "Oh, well, shit!" Like, I'm not gonna ask about it because like I don't know anything and I don't. I'm like, oh, actually, I looked at Sin and I'm like, honestly, he's probably already got it figured out in whatever capacity if he's talking about it. Yeah. And they were like, yeah. Well, actually, they may have said that. I don't remember. We were talking a lot. I was getting I was getting dressed, not rest. Why not dressed. both? Too, I w too dressed to rest. When when plans get delayed in the Uber late and you're too dressed to rest. <laughs> that part, but you're just sort of laying flat trying not to wrinkle oh, clothes. No. Your clothes will be fine. Your hair is fucked. That part. And it's trying to do the best. You can't. Do you know how hard it was? I got my wig to look like this today okay. with my bangs because normally I fuck with them constantly. You know okay. me. I'm, I'm a know fucker. You. Yeah. I fuck with things. Fuck with. Mm-hmm. I didn't have a good one for that, but yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck with. That was good. Fuck with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, stop saying yeah, 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 Steve. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Do Ooh. I lose a point? Ooh. <laughs> we don't have the...
So I have on on. I'll, I'll get to it. Oop. Yeah. Oop. Oop. Dead named. <laughs> By oneself. God, cancel me. Oop. Gosh, that's weird. I haven't had that in a moment. Well, that's well, yeah. I'm talking. I had my my other Adderall today, so I'm okay. trying to also like not be your step Adderall. Oh, I was yeah. I was trying to. I'm trying to be good today. Yeah. You got me. You know what? Can we can we start over? Tell three friends about the podcast and sound off in the trough below. You little content loving too. Hi, welcome to the Hell Yeah podcast. I am your host Seth. This is Eric. Hi. We just started. I. Just being honest. I I sous vide cooked chicken and it was so moist. Ooh, what does that mean, sous vide? That's like, is it like where you cook it in like wine or something? No, that's that's cook au vin. Um, okay. It, it, that, well, that's I mean that's chicken cooked in wine. Ray's pizza was really good. Okay. When we had it last, yes, it was very delicious. Yes, I do not like that they they did not have specials. Correct. And I'm like, oh, okay, I yeah. understand. Yeah. And I'm like, that's just how they do it in New York. Back to your sous vide chicken. So uh, it's like this: you you take a pot and you fill it with water, and then you you, know, you heard me. And then you take. I want a second one that's just quieter. Wow! So it's just wow, wow. wow. And, wow. and and then you take your protein. In my case, it was chicken breasts. I was like, I was about to ask how many scoops. <laughs> <laughs> it was two little chicken tibbies. Mm-hmm. Um, and I, I put them in a, in a bag. Okay. And then I vacuum sealed that bag. Mm-hmm. Well, actually, I poured a shitload of pesto in there with the chicken Ooh. breasts. Okay. So it's like a vacuum sealed marinade. Yes. And then uh, you immerse that bag in the water in that's the- in the pot. Is it boiling? Well, that's this. Here's the sous vide part of it. Then you have this little like your stick. It's like a sous vide stick, and you put it in the water, and it clips on the side of the of the bowl or the pot or the whatever you mm-hmm. got the water in the container. And then it keeps the water circulating at a specific temperature. In the case of this chicken, one hundred and forty five degrees. Ooh. And then it cooks, said chicken at one hundred and forty five mm-hmm. degrees and slowly moving hot water. Do you have to touch it? You don't have to stir it. It's stirred no, itself. No, it does everything. You just sit it in there, and it has to cook for more than an hour, but it can cook for up to four hours without it getting, like, nasty. Really? Uh-huh. So you just, like, boop, which was good because, like, I planned it out, like, two hours, but then, um, you know, it, it took longer to get home, mm-hmm. and so then it was, like, it was ready when we were ready, and then boom. Boom. That was perfect. We cracked it open. Was it good? Had a little taste of that chicken. It was the moistest chicken I've ever had in my entire fucking life. I love not juicy cuts. It was lovely. I couldn't imagine. Like not to be forty-two years old. Oh, I'm ready to talk Maine, about like I always am. Consistency. Yeah. But it was right, and it was good, and I was very pleased. I'm. I'm really. I'm actually really envious. Like it's the one thing I hate with like chicken. Uh, in a lot of ways that you cook it, and at least in my family, the the secret recipe is to make it dry. Sawdust. Yeah. Wood like, chips. Where like, oh, if I don't have barbecue sauce right. or something, like a sauce to dip it in that is cold yes. or like it has a semblance of wet, a, a, pro- a wet property. Indeed. Uh, it, it, it's like, ooh, ooh, don't you just eat the chicken? Or like fried chicken where the chicken's like rough. Yep. And you're just like, well, I ate the skin. And that was the good crunchy part. And, that, and yeah, but then why is the meat also crunchy? Mm-hmm. I don't want crunchy meat. Yeah. Dry, life, limp, lifeless. Six pound crunchy. eight ounce baby pizza. No. Wood, wood chippy, Chicken. nasty, flakes. It, it tastes tired. like gravelly, yeah. dirt ridden, um, lacking precipitation. Right. I want drought drizzled. <laughs> I like my chicken drought drizzled, dry, like ran, 
like a sand paper, not rand paper. Like Anne Rand. rand. Paper. <laughs> of course. <laughs> our our little bit this morning. Yeah, well, what was our bit this Run, morning? Run, rub, <laughs> rope, rope. I was on board. <laughs> I knew what you meant. I, I was I, I was so happy that you that your phone auto corrected Rue twice. No, yours did it first. No. Yes, you sent run. That's why I said run to make fun of you, and then I tried to say run again, and my phone auto corrected to rub, and then it became a bit, and I was like, okay, work. I love that it fucked mine up as well. Oh, okay. So I I lived this morning's bit that so you you, ne- you were hee hee ha ha ing. You never. Whenever we do this and like yours mistypes it and I send it back to you mistyped mocking you, you never clock that you fucked that your phone fucked it up first and you always then try to make fun of mine back to me. And I'm like, no, 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 no. We're joking on the joking on the joke. I didn't see. You got to let me know. You got to you got to message me in a separate chat <laughs> to let me know that I fucked up. <laughs> Because I, I, like, I really don't. I, it's funny that you say that because, like, <laughs> I fuck up shit all the time. I just, I normally catch it. I mean, the bit works just as well whether or not you do check. The, it's, like, it was I'm... funny as fuck either way. <laughs> yeah. And Rum would be right. So was Rub, like, because, like, was Rub a fuck up? Rub was a fuck up. Okay. And as soon as I hit send, I went, fuck. And then I was like, wait, no, this is good. This will be better. This, is, <laughs> this will be even better. Like, I didn't And then even... you volleyed off of Rub and it was perfect. Okay, good. I was like, because, like, there was no clocking right. involved. And, and normally, normally we would clock. But mm-hmm. uh, or if we were in person, verbally, we could clock. Yes. But uh, t- to be like, well, you called me Floptina Bestie. I said Floptina Bestie. That's what, yes, I did. Uh, and I said, flop to, I didn't know what to say. I stood in my living room for a few minutes trying to think of the right the right answer. Well, not a few minutes. I responded in the same minute. Yeah. But I took the greater part of a minute, which is a long time for me. Yeah. Uh, and then I was like, okay, but if I call you Eric Tina. Right. You already called me flop Tina. So I'm like, I got to do the whole quote. Yeah. Wearing a diaper. And Run would say, Eric Tina, you look amazing. <laughs> and Run would be right. Rub would be so true for that. Rope. <laughs> rope is so real. The road <laughs> the road was really good. The the road I, I wish I would have responded sooner after the road. <laughs> road is an icon. Because Trailblazer was very funny. Uh, double entendre. Mm-hmm. It was a it was a it was a it was a it was a, it was a classic Stefan Eric you know uh-huh. volley volley. Yeah. We we we're like Volley. Gilmore Girls. We're we're, s- we're we, so quick. We have that that back and forth. That repartee, that mm-hmm. witty repartee. The reporter. Repertoire. I don't. Okay. I'll allow it. I have a problem with Crunchyroll. Okay, and I'm listening to that problem about Crunchyroll. You will. Uh, we're gonna do hellos first. Hi. Hello. And welcome to, to the, the Hell Yeah, yeah Couch mm-hmm. Cast. I like that you didn't commit to saying anything, so we couldn't fuck it up. That works. <laughs> it's a little fisty. Uh, Thanks. A little fisty is what I. Nope. A little fisty if you miss me. Uh, I had unrelated to Crunchyroll thing, but one mm-hmm. of the the surgeon um, that Ooh. had um, Thank you. they they put in the the tube, the drain in my body. Right. He comes over to me and he goes, hello, I'm Dr. Feaster, and oh. I'm going to do this. And it was P-F-I-S-T-E-R. And it better be. And I, I wanted to look at him and be like, girl, you know it ain't Feaster. <laughs> we know it ain't Feaster, ladies. Honey, this ain't rising. <laughs> You're Mr. Fister. That part. And it took everything in my power to not be like, thank you, Mr. Fister. Thank you. So, And then I took a breath, <clears throat> and then I woke up. And it was over. And I said, that's it. And they're like, we're done. And I'm like, okay. Crunchyroll. Yes. Recently had three different shows I was watching finish. Okay. Free Rin finished. Uh, Mashal finished. Uh-huh. And uh, not Shangri-La, but apparently Solo Rising or Solo Leveling finished as well their season which is a little annoying because like that feels like i've watched 12 episodes of a show that's about to start my thing that i'm upset about is not this weekend but the weekend before 
episodes 24, episode 24, yep. episode 12 came out. Like, okay. end good 12 episode season content, 24 episodes, it's done. So I go on Saturday, and I'm like, I wonder if there's going to be any more episodes. I was surprised to know that Solo Leveling's finale was the last episode I watched, because I thought, well, the show's starting now, I guess. That's cool. Mm-hmm. Uh, after episode 7.5, which was a recap of the first seven episodes. Okay. Which apparently also happens in the Mangua. Mangua? The Mangua. That's what Danny is, a Korean manga. Okay. Yeah, but uh, it, it almost, <laughs> I know, it was it was good. Okay. Uh, yeah, a little Mangua. Thank you. <laughs> mangua is spelled like M-A-N-G-O-I-R-E. Why wouldn't it be? Do you have your Mangua on? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. What? Your grimoire? No. It's a just brief diversion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll remember <clears> my. I'm mad that they said there was new episodes. Like the new thing said new episodes. And then I'm like, and no. It was a liar. No, it's the same episodes from last week. And I'm like, but you removed the thing and put them on again. Like they for, didn't they didn't know that there wasn't new ones. Oh, I don't like that. Yeah, that's why I didn't like it. So a brief diversion. So picture it. It's Trans Visibility Day, also known as Easter. Oh, yeah, 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 right. <laughs> and we, she had risen. <laughs> and we needed food. It's Herster. Sorry. Okay, so you needed food on We needed Easter. food. Where are you guys going to go? Everything's closed. That's the problem. How do you, well, you have to go find the barn in Bethlehem. Well, and it was late. In the North Star. Did like, you, did three wise men should have just gone you? to sleep because that's like my M.O., when hungry but late. I was to say, so it was 7.15? It was 9 p.m. Actually, that's not true. I just lied. It was 8.30 p.m. Thank you and for And I'm going to tell you why. I appreciate the honesty. It was 8.30 p.m. We were like, let's get Jimmy John's. That was not an option available to us well, it's at 8.30 p.m. on an Easter Sunday. Maybe it was because of the trans visibility you wouldn't, day. You would, well, no. I think it's because you wouldn't get it in 30 minutes before they closed anyway. That could be beef. Um, I got beef. So then we were like, well, fuck. Uh, where else could we go? We were like, oh, we could go to In-N-Out. Well, you silly me, In-N-Out famously, you know, putting With their Christ- putting scripture on they their have cups a, there's and There's a shit. day they're closed early? Uh, Easter, evidently. I was like, oh, religious nut jobs over Ooh. at the In-N-Out. I don't know if they're religious nut jobs, but clearly they have religious leanings. And so they took Easter off and you know what? Okay, work. But we needed food. So the only option left. I don't care that people got to spend time with their families. I was Who hungry. Who wants to spend time with their families Easter evening? Who wants to spend time with their families? Period. Period. <laughs> right. Like. Right. You hunt the eggs in the morning. You Shout go out to, for family. You go to church if you're that sort, and then it's over. So like, what? It's eight thirty p.m. We're back to business. Jesus is uh, he's okay now. He's done. Allegedly, we already saw he's gone from the from the the cave. Mm-hmm. It's not like he went back in the cave. Right. The situation had settled itself by eight thirty p.m. He got up and he said five more minutes, and he went back and he pulled the rock back. Right. So like by eight thirty p.m., we're good. So in and out should have been open. So our only option available to us was Taco Bell. I famously don't eat Taco Bell. I, I was, I, yeah, no, you, 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 you at like, this is I don't shocking. do that. This is, I am shook right I now. I don't do that. You went to Taco Bell. And I have, listen, and I'm not saying this from any sort of a pretentious position. I have nothing against Taco Bell conceptually. I don't think anything like that. I just don't like the food there, period, point blank, period. People do, and I love that for them. I don't. Yeah. We, but we, options were scant. Mm-hmm. You could get, I mean, if you went to Del Taco, you could have got a burger. <sighs> but Taco Del Taco was too far away. And so it was like, and, and no, because you're getting a lot of risk to go to that Del Taco. Well, right. And Jordan was already driving. So I was like, you want Taco Bell. I will deal with Taco Bell. Do it. Like go through the drive-thru. Meanwhile, the drive-thru is like around the fucking building because it's 830 and everything else is closed. And like mm-hmm. Taco Bell is all anyone's got. So we're like, and well, you have shit. to do that weird like in where I like that in and out takes up more of the parking lot than I feel so like much of that own. parking lot. Good luck getting to Taco Bell dipshit. Good luck. So we finally we get, in, we get into Taco Bell. I'm looking up on my phone what's on the Taco Bell menu because I'm like, it can't see the sign yet. No, 
is the line backed up? Yes, because it's eight thirty p.m. and everything else. Oh, is closed. oh, it's wrapped. Though the line is wrapped around yes. the building. So we at Taco Bell. At Taco Bell. So we that one. Yes, that Taco Bell, <laughs> Ta- which famously has to have a sign up saying "We're open" in all caps. It's tough. It is tough. It's tough out here for a bitch. Yeah. Sad. Failed. Um. Flopped. When you can see the in and out line, but they closed for Easter. So we get, we find, so I'm looking it up on my phone because I'm like, I'll find something. And I did. And I didn't, when I ultimately got it, I didn't enjoy it, but that's not what the story is about. What this, because, so suffice it to say, long story short, this is not a story of like success and barbecue joy. Sauce I still don't. Over. You can't get barbecue sauce. Then. I still don't care for Taco Bell, but um, I wouldn't expect you But to. I made it through. But that's not the point of the You're story. You're so strong. <clears throat> I really am. I'm brave, and no one acknowledges that. I think you've done well. Thank you. I think Thank you. I honestly, I think you deserve uh, more recognition and honestly a cash prize. Thank you. So we get up to the window. Well, we get up to the the menu mm-hmm. with the little box where they talk to you. And, the little uh, man in the box. Yeah, and it was a uh, it was a little woman in the box. Oh, and uh, <clears throat> lady box. Yeah, and and oh, <laughs> and she clearly is just like you know it's eight thirty on Easter. They close at nine. She's just trying to have fun for her last thirty minutes. Love her for that. Um, and so we're, we're ordering stuff and she's having a good time. You know, she's like kind of like riffing and everything. Uh-huh. And so then she's bit bapping. She's bit bopping. Is she brap rapping on her dirt bike? A little bit. Okay. And so then we get to like, you know, so, uh, uh, Jordan goes to order his and he, you know, orders like a, I don't remember what he gets, like taco or something and at the bell, maybe he ordered the bell. Um, and then, uh, <laughs> And, and so then he has to order his drink and he's like, uh, can I get a, um, the, uh, a, the strawberry freeze drink actually? And she goes, there's like a brief pause and she goes, sure. Why not? And I start dying laughing. I'm dying laughing in the passenger seat. Cause I just, I would die for this woman. I, everything. The sass. Just, just, and it was just, just so nonchalant and just, sure. Why not? Yeah, she's right. just like she's just feeling Add it on do it so i, I start care. laughing she's like i don't have to make it i don't give a shit exactly so i start laughing so then jordan mm-hmm. starts laughing so now the woman can hear us laughing so then she starts laughing and i'm like oh good she can laugh at her own laugh we love oh. that and it's just a great time we got up there and then like got the food and the food was not great but i love it i love the attitude of like an 8 an 8 30 p.m easter sunday just can i get this to drink <laughs> sure why not well, no, Jordan had to think about it, which means he didn't have his order ready beforehand. He didn't have his drink ready. He changes his drink order up. I'm Is like, it, he should be getting the Baja Blast. Well, uh, so anywhere that I go, people always know. <laughs> Charlie <C. laughs> has got a weenie that he likes to show. That he likes to show. So uh, everywhere that I go, I get either a Diet Coke a diet conk or a diet beepus. You on that cocky or beepy? Yeah. Yeah. But slim. Yeah. Sl- slim beepy or slim conk. Mm-hmm. Always. Watching your figure. Yeah. Always. Like there's no there's no change. There's no debate. You're on your soda twink. Yeah, of course. Okay. 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 Right. 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 It doesn't change. Doesn't change. Doesn't change. <laughs> doesn't change. Doesn't change. <laughs> right. Change. Famously. Never change. <laughs> doesn't never change. <laughs> Change. It's like T C H. Yeah. Change. To change. It's like tzatziki. Mm-hmm. It's like Ooh. that, but to change. To change. Tzatziki. Yeah. Muhammad. But like, he gets something different all the time. Mm-hmm. Like sometimes it's Coke Zero. If they don't have Coke Zero, he's like, uh, lemonade or root beer or strawberry freeze. And I'm like, it is Coke Zero then lemonade then root beer or 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 blue Powerade. At Jimmy John's? He, he got a blue Powerade at Jimmy John's. At Jimmy John's, this man gets blue Powerade almost every time we go. Religion is really tearing our country apart. <laughs> I think it's the lack of religion, actually. I don't know. Whatever it is, it needs to be fixed. <laughs> I, I, blue Powerade. Blue Powerade. Get into you, it. You're going. You're drinking blue Powerade through a straw. What? Did I beat your ass? <laughs> Better get into it. No, I'm not getting into blue Powerade. <laughs> Better get into it. You notice they don't even have red Powerade. That part. Which, first of all, ooh, 
like, oh, hey, yeah, we have a blue raspberry drink. No, Powerade doesn't count. It's not blue raspberry. Quit First, selling second, it. and third of all. I don't care what it is. It's blue. Exactly. But, okay, so, okay, 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 okay. Right, right. Here's a quick question. What, what, no off-topic questions. Thank you, but this is on topic. Oh, okay. My apologies. Uh, uh, yeah, right, right. So why is it that, quote unquote, uh-huh, allegedly, sports drinks, anything, any, any of the power aids, gator Big aids, three. things yeah. of that nature? What's the third? Vitamin water. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what about body armor? I don't. Mm. Look, I'm. I'm not here for lower shelf items. Thank you. Soby counts. Ew. It's not good, but like I just I like I like Sobe as a sports drink. No, Sobe's just the drink that like I'm of only champions. here for the aesthetics. Like the little lizard. Yeah, I want the lizard bottle. Glass bottle, pop that cap. Yeah, I don't want to drink it. I actually wouldn't want to. I, every time I got one as a kid, it was disappointing. Yeah, but I love it. I love Sobe. Why are sports drinks that are blue, not blue raspberry and not blueberry, they're this sport blue? flavor or they're like it's berry blue blast punch mountain well that's being bold. rain gatorade has a flavor that's called cool blue Th- that part i'm like what is sports blue what is that flavor because it's not blue raspberry and it's not blueberry because i love blue raspberry and i love blueberry i don't like sport blue see cool blue fucks though what about Glacier Freeze? That one I can fuck with a little bit, but I still would rather but Glacier have. Freeze is kind of like that off blue, or is it the purple one? Yeah. One of them? I just want an, I just want to talk. Yeah. I just want to know. You should go to the University of Florida and yell at them. They made them. Both? Yeah, that's where it's from. Because the Both? University of Florida Gators. Both of? The D's Nuts. Powerade also? And Bank of America. Well, we're at it, yeah. They also made Powerade. Okay. Um... They also manned one of the Voyager <laughs> shuttles. Yeah. Yeah. One of the satellites. Was it the one that in the future is going to become like this gigantic spaceship that threatens Earth? I hope so. And that we have to make whales talk to it. But the problem is that blue whales went extinct in the past because of an environment. Well, we, do disaster. we have any cool blue whales? <laughs> I don't like sport we have, blue. We have Barry Mountain Blast. <laughs> I said what I said. I don't like sport blue. I, Continue. I, I don't understand why they would make it like that. Like why they just aren't clear and concise about. Very unclear. Very blue. The and flavor. Stuff like that. Well, it makes it difficult to be like, well, what's it taste like? Blue. Blue. Which is like. Or they're, or when they do stuff where it's like, it's Mountain Rush. I'm like, so what, it tastes like running dirt. I, I don't want to read the really thin, small font that gives you. It's like a hint the, of citrus just flavor. Just artificial and natural flavors. We took actual dog shit. We ground it up and then we we spray painted it blue and then we put it near a blueberry. Yeah, I don't like sport blue. I don't like plasticky faces neither. I don't like the plasticky faces. I don't, I don't like the plasticky hair. I don't, I don't like any of it. Yeah, I I don't know what to tell you. I wish I had a better answer. I kind of dislike how red is typically fruit punch. Fruit punch. When it could just be cherry. Because cherry is superior to it. fruit Thank punch. Um, I understand that not everybody... Cherry is very decisive or divisive where you either love it or hate it. Which I didn't know mm-hmm. until I met someone who hates cherry. I thought you hated cherry. I actually. love cherry. I know you. Well, I guess that's silly that I say that now. There's some things where I feel like you didn't like cherry. I don't like any real fruits. Oh, yeah, I don't want to eat them. But I love artificial fruit flavor. I I I love the I love that Zantam gum. Grapes. <laughs> Shit are, gets me fucked like, up. Grapes are nasty. Grape flavor. Ooh, they're not the same. Ooh, grape flavor is different. Right. Grape flavor tastes like purple. We are not the same. Don't not associate. Cherries don't associate. Gross. With. Don't want that. Um, cherry mm. flavor. Fuck me over. Well, yeah, because cherries are like representative of like virginity for or whatever. Gimopy. Which I'm like, nah, not for me. I have to have the cherry flavor because it busts. Strawberries. No, they got the bumpies. Yeah. Strawberry flavor though. Bend me over. I will eat a strawberry, and then I and go. I wish you would. And I go. Oh, uh, I might. <laughs> uh, I go, oh, it's a strawberry. And then I eat it because I told the person I was next to that I was going to eat it. Okay. I don't 
I don't dislike it. Yeah. But I don't like it. I like the clarification. I appreciate that. I know you. You. That's that's something that's really important for you. I will say that I actively this do not like almost any fruit except for apples. But I actually really like a lot of vegetables. I heard you out here eating an apple. Oh. There we go. Yeah. Apples are pretty much the only fruit I like. And don't cook them. If you cook the apple, that's fucking disgusting. Also, don't make it into sauce. That's fucking disgusting. Also, don't juice it. That's fucking disgusting. Apple juice, gay. Just give me a, <laughs> just give me a cr- honey crisp, crisp, oh, honey that crisp apple. Good. I'll have a Granny Smith. A bi- yeah, I love them too. But like my favorite apple is a big honker of mm-hmm. a honey crisp uh, apple. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good one. Yeah. I, I agree with you. I it's the best apple and every other fruit can just suck a wee wee yeah that's right but vegetables love them asparagus broccoli cauliflower green beans potatoes carrots fuck me up with that shit not brussels sprouts you eating carrots i eat carrots not brussels sprouts though that's fucking disgusting and i'm not gonna learn to like brussels sprouts no i'm not i don't like them brussels sprouts they're my favorite yeah they (laughs) no you don't like (laughs) yeah hate it i'm trying to think i love lettuce a big fan of lettuce get down with cabbage even i've had cabbage not a big fan of spinach I don't mind spinach as a part of something. Because I love being able to pull the spinach out because it didn't chew up with the rest of the lettuce. And And then I go and I put it on the... Arugula, very bitter. But if it's in the Mm. mix, we can can work with it. I can live with it. If I'm not looking at it, I'll eat it. If he's just part of the leafy greens, Mm -hmm. we can roll. Asparagus? No. I love asparagus. Never again. Oh, I love it. You should go to the Asparagus Festival in Stockton, California. They brought it back. That sounds horrible. It's, it is it is terrible. It's not a fun experience. It sounds horrible. I hated it. I love asparagus and it sounds horrible. It, it's a really big festival. There were so many people last time I was there when I was a child. <laughs> were there a lot of people or did it just seem like a lot because you were small? No, 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 no. There oh, was no. quite a lot of area to cover. Okay. Like It was this massive park. It was a big thing. I, I remember being a kid and I was shocked. Because I'm weird and I care Surely about these there things. there can't be more asparagus. I wasn't a child. I was a kid. <laughs> and there is a difference. I was like nine. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. There is. <laughs> I wasn't like five going like, damn, this place is huge. I'm obsessed now with saying thank you to things that are like just statements that don't warrant thanks. I... It's fun. Thank you. It's my new that like that part. Yeah. Oh, it's you, my you new picked, like you picked up something. It's new. my new vocal stem of one of those sort of like where you know when someone can say anything and I'll just go T or like that part or like mm-hmm. you know anything like that. Right. The new one is that like specifically it's if it's something that I shouldn't be like thanking someone for it, just say thank you. Like um just like a basic statement. We have packages today. Thank you. Yeah, I see. Okay, I get it. Yeah. Although I feel like that probably wasn't the best example. That one wasn't the best example. It would be a better example knowing that I'm the one that got the packages. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It, it would be because right. then it's like, thank you. Right. Like, bitch, I knew that. But you have to do it the same way. Where you're like, thank you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I like thank you, just like flat, like almost declarative. Thank you. Exactly. Like, because I'm not trying to be like sarcastic or anything. I'm, just, I, like, I didn't say you. it correctly. Let me make it a bit heavier. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It pissed me off that Brandon said that. Yeah, he he loves to come after you for that. Uh, oh, oh. It's almost like he's insecure. Oh, insecure boys love coming after me. Tito. Let me tell you. Thank you. I texted him yesterday. Okay. I, he didn't respond. Wait, Word. did I actually send it? I might not have texted him. <laughs> Okay, I'm I, obsessed with the idea of you not sending something and then being like, this fucking asshole won't respond to me. <laughs> that is me. <laughs> <laughs> me who forgot to text. Like, I've been meaning to text you and I could have swore I texted you, but yeah. then I got distracted. Yeah. Well, one, I, I did say, he asked me if I wanted cat food because yes. Lainey, they switched her to new food. Famously. And he was like, I was like, well, shit, like, that's not the food that he eats, though. Right. And he's like, I was like, I have to like teach him. And he's like, well, he's like, you could just mix it in. And I'm like, I didn't tell him this because it would have resulted in me having to come over and get the cat food. But like, I was out of cat food. There's nothing to mix it with. Work. I'm not just dry switching him. Right. 
And like, and he doesn't want it. I don't want him to have it. Nobody wants it. But you know what he wants? What does he want? He wants to watch stream. And with his little paws. With his little feces. So I did send that to Brandon. Okay. The thing I meant to send to Brandon, I think, was another picture. Oh, I sent it to you instead. Um, that tracks. The, uh, <laughs> the, the money talks. <laughs> well, both <laughs> <Both> the whispers. <laughs> <laughs> a rich in our life oh my god i forgot i i it, it wasn't so much like the larger i really debated like how much of the meme to crop it right but just the idea of of, of francine whispers. from american dad money, money talks. talks lois griffin well whispers i figured that would be a good one that we would enjoy that is good and i did enjoy that yeah brand I, I you know i will send it to i'll send it to, what time is it it's time it's like four thirty nine, but he could want to hang out Schedule the send. Schedule the send. Schedule the send. Girl, you can't do that. Oh, it's all I ever do. You ske- That's why you get back to me if when you, you do. If you think you can for one second that I don't come up with most of the things I need to text at about mm, 11.57 p.m. and then go, I shouldn't send that right now because that might be annoying, but I also don't want people to know that I'm scheduling the send, so I, instead of setting it for like... 8 a.m., which is the default. I'm like, mm, let's send it at 7:43. <laughs> you fucking bitch! <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? And I'm over here thinking, wow, you got up and 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 responded to me. Thanks, because like I don't expect you to respond to me half the time, right? But it does surprise me when you do. Where yeah. I'm like, oh, work, bitch. Okay, you're yeah, up. I'm up. Part like, of it. Must be. I get up early now. You're er, you're an er, you're, you're an early riser. Yeah. What can you say? Are you going on bike again? No. 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 Is bike up in the dust place? The dust. The garage. Place. I mean, it's in the garage. I don't know. I assume that you put the bike up because the bike not coming down. Oh, actually, right now the bike is down because we reorganized the garage. Oh, did you? Mm-hmm. Nice. Mm-hmm. Let me text this to Brandon. I have gotten up at. Thirty every single weekday for the last like month, and oh. it has actually felt really good. Really? Mm-hmm. Well, I guess because you've been working, like yeah. you've been having a lot of work to do. It is nice when you get into that routine. It feels good. I've been I've been on that um. So, I have to qualify this with um one of my coworkers recently left the company. Right. Who was the person in charge of our morning meeting. Okay. Oh. My morning meeting used to be Monday at 9.30. Yep. No, I think it was Monday. Yeah, I think it was Monday at 9. Okay. And then Wednesday at 7.30 and Friday at 7.30. Okay. It's our little huddle meeting. Right. Well, with him going, mm-hmm. and apparently un- possibly related to that, it was when I was in the hospital. Mm-hmm. They decided to switch Ooh. over to so that the original boss yep. ran the meeting. Yep. Which meant we have to do it on his schedule, which means we have daily meetings at 7.30 a.m. again every day. Every day? Mm-hmm. Mm. You yeah. know how you fix that? Don't show up? No. That's what I did half the time when I got out of the hospital. Volunteer to take over the meeting. That's that part. Be like, oh, no, like, I can organize it. I'll set it up. Like, I know that, you know, ex-employee did it. I'll, okay. I'll take that on. Like, I know you're so busy, boss. I got this. And I won't I won't have this be part of my raise. No. Nope. Conversation. No. Nope. I'll, I'll, I'll leave it separate. Right. And I then that's fine. And then you just set the terms. I, we should. And I think, like, we, we discussed it. Because in our meeting today, uh, he was like, actually, I he's been out of town. And then he's going to be out of town even more. Everyone's going out of town right now. Uh-huh. And I'm like, fine. He goes, so I'm going to go ahead. And, <laughs> he's like, since I'll be on a plane tomorrow, I'll go ahead and cancel tomorrow's meeting. I'm like, oh, thank God. You better. And then Mark calls me immediately after and he goes, hey, so since uh, he's not coming in, do you want to like, are you planning on coming in? I'm like, no. If you think that I'm coming into the office. One second. I It's come to my attention are, that there's no requirement for me to be at the office. Are you going? For the spring fling. I hadn't planned on it. Are you going? <laughs> I am. Fuck, now I want to go. 
party. I was going to ask if you were going because it's just going to be hot dogs. Let's fling. I told Mark I wasn't going to go. Lie. It's fun. What if I went like this? I wore a little mask. Work, fling. Work? I, maybe I'll find love. Maybe I'll find love on the roof with a hot dog. It could happen. <sighs> Stranger things. Wiener, it could, I, I'm just looking You could have wiener a Wiener weekend. Wednesday. <laughs> a Wiener Wednesday for me. Also, when are we doing French Fry Friday? So that is a good question. And yeah. something else that... And I'd... you need to give me a good answer. Okay. Are you feeling anxiety yet? Because I want an answer now. Uh, if you want it I'm right kidding. now. Well, so that was... I, I That is something that uh, in, in the essence of like stuff that I'm also going to need to... Like, uh, so Couchcast is on episode three. OVA. OVA. You may get a fourth one so that we're consistent because we are good about being... Was it only four? We only did four episodes Oh, before. it felt like a lifetime. And I mean that in the best way. Uh, one of those episodes was The Cabin. Ah. Mm-hmm. Which that we was get, one we of get the lo- four? Or yeah, was that an addition that, no, to the that four? No, was, that was one of the four. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Which is, that's why, like, because, like, whenever we talk about The Cabin, we lose a couple days. So, right. Yeah. But, yeah, we did four. Um, okay. But uh, kind of putting up like content calendar because like people also have asked me about when we're getting another Team Rocket episode, which I all there's so many things I want to do, but I also don't want to overload the channel with like us doing a bunch of shit. Mm-hmm. And we're not making a second one as far as I know. For t- t- I have, we'd have to not say cunt on the second channel. I mean, we say cunt on this one. Yeah, but well, I guess. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We're still not. We're still part of the partner program. We're not. We are. Are we? Yeah. Are we, are we really in it? Oh, because we because had we, to be in order to monetize the streams. Oh, but we don't monetize any of our videos, so we can't get it taken away. Oh, don't worry. They still can. Oh. Because they did. They better not have. Is it because of the podcast? Did they find out you have they a podcast? They found out about the podcast, and oh, they no? said, we heard that on another channel. Well, you don't you make say the podcast. Con. Yes, I do. In all of your videos? It's in my link tree. It's I don't notice it as the first line in your description, and it's then in my as link. a and there's not a promo in the first five seconds of your video, and I go, hmm. It's in my link tree. Curious. Links below. I don't plug the podcast in half my videos. Needs in bio. <laughs> I forget to. I do. I do update it on my stream. I have the little check out the newest episode with the little the title and everything, and Zuki writes about it. He has thoughts. None of which I want to share. None of which are important. But it's in the link tree. I'll go verify. It's in the link tree. Mm-hmm. Right. right. Leave that phone there. I'm just going right to check there. real quick. <laughs> Look it up. Give me the view. I need it. <laughs> <laughs> now you do. I do. We got to get you We gotta get you to 200. The unmitigated goal yeah. of them to put in the email where they're like, hey, girly, hey, Floptina, mm-hmm. you're canceled. You're kicked hey, out. Hey, slut. You're, you're a little whore. You're, you're a little, fucking harlot. You're a little mud grub. Who's out like getting it in the streets mm-hmm. and you're not getting our money anymore. They also said, let, let the door hit you on the way out. They also said, but don't worry, this won't affect how I shouldn't even say this. Oh, because YouTube, oh. they're listening. Well, we could pause. They were like, if this won't affect, like, you know, your video getting recommended to anyone else, I'm like, okay, sure. Yeah. <laughs> isn't that a big, isn't that a big promotion of being in the partner program is that you have better <laughs> visibility in the algorithm no sh- it's not, not a real thing it feels like it, it feels like it, it, it it's like a shadow thing it's not a real thing no no, no. you get shadow recommended it's not a thing it's not it's not a thing i love susan wojcicki isn't she gone uh, no i think she's with sully flying over the river sully it was a Monster Zinc and then the I the was gonna Captain say, Sullivan. I thought, I thought that was a one two. <laughs> and was I was a, a little like, okay. It's a weird two thousand eight callback, but I'm here for it. Thank you. I think. I had something peculiar happen in, in Pokemon Go two days in a row. Tell me about this peculiar thing that happened. I went on a walk okay. near my house. That is peculiar. It is peculiar. It's new. Yep. It's a new it's a new walk and Things. New stomping grounds. Thank you. I went up to the trail and I Loves did. It. I cr- was able to create my own route. Nice. Yeah. And I think I might make a second one because I did one where I went up and then like the the path forks. So yeah. you can go left or right. Fork way up and high. Doubles. Yeah. Fork and doubles. And so if you take the right path, you kind of like come back down the mountain. It's yes. Like, because on Pokemon Go, the trail is actually like street. Nice. So I'm like, oh, I don't need to look where I'm going. Yeah. 
I have Pokemon Go to Pokemon guide me. Pokemon Go will guide my Protect path. me from an Ekans. <laughs> um, oh, a Skaroopy. Uh, but uh, so I was walking and I was like just around the corner from my house and I see an Onyx. And I went, it better not be shiny because like shiny Onyx is yellow. Giant Gems collection. Yeah. Well, I already have a shiny. Tiny st- Treasures, Giant Gems. I have, yeah, correct. I have a shiny Steelix. Okay, we love that. I have, I've had it. I click on it. It's a shiny Onyx. So Loves I name it. it Beads. Loves it. Thank you. Catch it. Loves it. Thank the you. The next day, I go on a walk. Okay. Outside of my house. Okay. I go around the corner. Okay. And there's an Onyx. Okay. And I went. It surely can't. It surely couldn't be shiny. It simply couldn't I be. I click on it. It's a fucking shiny Onyx. Work. I don't remember what I named him because I don't care. Probably second shiny Onyx. Yeah. Oh, that would have been the third. T. The second shiny Onyx, the third. Real tea. Thank you. Oh, also pro tip to all my girlies who are working on 10 best buddies as someone who just got their sixth best buddy. Love that. If you type in buddy yeah. in search, it's a whole pain in the ass. You can type in buddy four mm-hmm. as one word, and I just found that out recently. And buddy four helped until I have I only got two in there, and then everything else is buddy three and lower, and I'm like, this is something I have to make a, a task of. Yeah, I figured that out and was like, buddy four, nothing. Buddy three, Nothing. Uh, Buddy two, about four of them. And I went, can't wait to get 10 best buddies. Oh, yeah. The real so trick. So I made a tag, and I tagged the ones that I'm going to make best buddies. Mm-hmm. And I'm about two out of 10. <laughs> Did you know? So One of which is a reunculus. So you can you can switch them. You can switch your buddies 20 times a day. I know. So do you basically like. I should, and I don't. make it, Yeah, that's what, I, that's what I, I've been yelling at myself for a year. I have I have not been prioritizing it. You can do the thing where you just you take a picture, you do the thingy thingy thingy, you feed them berries, and then you swap. So you get like five or three or like three or four hearts right away. You could do a battle if you really want to, and that would be the best way to do it. But I'm just gonna come out and say it: it's not worth shiny Jirachi. That's how I feel. Notice I started with I feel, (laughs) (laughs) and you can feel that way. That's not how I feel about Shiny Jirachi. How do you feel about Shiny Jirachi? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Flagged. <laughs> I feel like that. Sometimes we get, I don't know how long we're allowed to play it before. Never as long as we do. Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah. There we go. That's safe. I, uh, I like Shiny Jirachi. I just want a Jirachi. You don't have one? I think I have one. I want Shiny. Sadly. Like I have a Celebi and a Cerebi. Flip to best of. Flaptino. Flaptino rice. <laughs> Flaptino. <laughs> Flaptino. 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 Mm-hmm. I, just being honest, hatched a shiny lullaby. Ooh. Yep. Yesterday during the Salamence event. That's kind of nice. There was three big on outside my house because I did all my walking before the event. Loves it. I mean, I already have a shiny salamence, so I'm not too. We'll get another one. I don't want it. No, I'm okay. Delete the other one. So that's delete the your first one and get a new one. No, well, mm, if it was good. Ooh. Well, this one I caught in Chicago, actually. Okay. So I kind of like that on one. On the L. Uh. I don't think we were on a bus. <laughs> we might have been on a bus. I don't remember now. Oh, we might. I might have been. I'm, I don't think I was on the L. That's a train. It is a train. Train. See, that's my girly. Oh, okay. She's cute. It's my shiny girly. Mm-hmm. Manda. You don't. Na- you don't nickname your shinies. Only if they really matter. Mm. Right. I Ooh. caught my. So I have my tiniest, my teeniest, tiniest whalemer. So I have my shiny. Judy. I have my shiny, and he. I love him dearly. Mm-hmm. His name is Space Whale. He's one of the very few Pokemon's I name. But I caught my tiniest, lightest, shortest little baby, baby, name, baby name boy Whalemer. It's a little wave. Well, his CP is six six six. Oh. So I just named him Satan, just classic. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. he's my tiny little baby Satan boy. A little little devil. And I love him. I love him. He's that tiny, and I love him. Is he bouncy? I feel like Whalemer would bounce. Feel bounces. I, he might. Mm-hmm. He just might. If you kick a spoink, it'll bounce once. Oh. Twice if it passes out. <sighs> Nasty. I just found a whalemer right now here in your house. I hope it's yours. It's a giant gem. Well, no, it's not. Yes, it is. It's a regular sized one. Giant gems and tiny treasures. 
I'm just gonna keep saying that. They're talking about my tits and my <laughs> <laughs> my giant my, tits and my tiny my, little. Pussy. Well, I was gonna say it was my giant my giant balls and my tiny little asshole. But okay, I don't. No, I liked yours a lot better. I'm trying to be gender affirming here. No, 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 no. You you did right. I I just it, my my penchant for just doing the opposite. It sometimes doesn't always work in my favor. I found it. I just found a tiny diglet. He's a little elevator button down there. What? He's he's tiny. He's just my little elevator button. He's just a boop, little boop, boop. Boop. yeah, just a little yeah, like a little micro, like boop boop. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I did get I did uh, hatch a salandit. Okay, that was female. Oh, for the first, finally! I finally got a salazzle, and like loves it. She fucks. Loves it. Have you seen her? Of course, I've seen okay. her. I want a white one. Oh. oh, well, it's shiny. Why is the copy white? Cause Tell three friends about the podcast and sound off. And- <laughs> I didn't have a good one. For that. <laughs> uh, that was good. Uh, I trying to think. Ooh, I got a shiny Wimpod. Okay, bitch. With the red. Nice. It's gonna look very good. Uh, there is beads, and then I named the other shiny onyx Weedle. <laughs> I mean Weedle, actually, if if I may. That part. Um, trying to think. I don't want to see hatched Pokemon. <laughs> I don't want to get that hatched Pokemon off the television. I don't want to see that. Let me see recent shiny Pokemon that I own. How many shinies do you own? Mm. I own one hundred and seventy three. But a lot of them are duplicates. Not a, not that many. But like the whole the whole point of like, why don't you just get one if you already have one? Is because I have so many shiny fucking Fennekin. I have so many fucking. I have shiny... one hundred and twenty seven. Good, less than me. Yeah, you have repeats mm-hmm. though, and they're sad. Yeah, they're sad little flops. I could evolve this shiny Eevee right now, but I won't. Ugly, ugly flop. I did catch a wild shiny Eevee, which is insane. Love that. And Love then that. I immediately panicked because like. I don't want to get fucked again. I got a shiny Vika Volt and then found out that like Ooh. it's actually good. Yeah, Vika Volt's really cool. I don't know how good it is in Pokemon Go. No, but... I mean in Pokemon Go it's good. Oh, work. As okay. far as bug types, I mean all bugs suck, but you know. Yeah. It's as good as you're going to get. Right. 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 Yeah. Right. Um to think. Oh, bitch, I forgot I I did get a uh, a shiny I think I think this was I think we already talked about this. Mm. I got a shiny um Simi poor or pan poor? Yes. Yeah. Named her full poor. You know what I didn't nickname was the Rayquaza you gave me. I I think I'm gonna name him Ray Romano. I love that. I feel like my shiny Hisuian Decidueye is pretty rare. But also yeah. he was the very first one that I got when I caught Hisuian Decidueye, so I'm like, they must have upped these raids. This is crazy. Do you have a shiny slowpoke with a cowboy hat on? I don't. God, I wish I did. I do. He's the sheriff. I love that. Can't Fucking evolve. Can't love do that. nothing. He with doesn't it. need to. No, he's perfect. You've seen that hat? He's got one star. He's got one foot in the star. Uh, you and one please. foot elsewhere. Please. Anywho, I have a shiny execute, and I will not evolve it until they do that like silly little event again, where what's a tiny dig? Where an executor will evolve into, into a low Lolan, yeah. Which they've only done once, and they did it on Easter like four years ago, and they didn't do it on this trans visibility day. Interesting. <laughs> I didn't know that uh, <coughs> there would be a little transphobic. Bless you, bless you, bless you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> You, that's right. Don't don't say the trans visi- trans day visibility name in vain. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Maybe that was God upset that you didn't talk about Easter. I did though. You mentioned it, and it I gave it. credit where it was due. I think that's fine with you. I. Oh shit! That's what I was also talking to you about. I did the tournament. Remember I talked about how I was going to be in a Pokemon tournament? Yes. One second. Good. Okay, yeah. So just a second ago, before that weird pause that just happened. Mm -hmm. Where is that light coming from? That dappled sunlight upon my face. Is it coming from, I think it's the edge of your blinds right there? How disgusting. All right. 
I'm I think. Scoot over like this. I'm yeah. gonna give you my full attention. Thank you. So I, ha- I was in a Pokemon tournament a couple weeks ago, and uh, I uh-huh. had mentioned it. Yeah. And I said, "Hey, come on, come on by." Yeah. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play the Pokemon. I'm gonna be in the tournament. And I gotta say, I had a lot more energy and enthusiasm when I was starting to say this. Before I had to ago. then leave. Yeah. So instead, I went and took a picture, posted it on Instagram with a caption and, and everything about how I currently felt because um, uh, it was a fun tournament. Um, I was knocked out immediately. <laughs> I got too old. <laughs> hey, Stinky! <laughs> Hell yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've been sitting here going, oh, I can't <laughs> wait for this payoff when you get back. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> that so, being said. So yeah. what happened? Gen 3. So I was Gen 3, and I don't really know competitive battling all that well. Like, I probably could have made, like, a weather team. With Gen 3, because, like, weather was big in Gen 3. Weather the weather. Correct. Whatever weather, the weather. Whatever, whenever. Whenever we weather were not. No, I was trying to do... Wait, no. Oh, my God, I love Poker Face. Oh, my God, yes, I love Poker Face. Yes. Yes. Right. Ma, 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 ma. How... How did she go to the Born This Way concert and she's still not an ally? I'm sorry. I had that conversation with Jordan like a week ago where I made that little joke. Well, she was more of an ally back then. (laughs) And then she got a hold of YouTube shorts and certain podcasts. And that's T. Oh, word. I can't believe he took her from that. (laughs) Um, he had to build his stable. You were, oh, real quick correction. Oh, uh, uh, corrections for last week's episode. I'll get back to my point. Love when we give corrections. Uh, I am aware that the I in LGBTQIA plus stands for intersex and not for ace. Um, Jehovah, please so refer to I. my previous statement where I said, I'm in the T, so I come first. So... <laughs> But no, uh, I I realized it afterwards when we were watching it that I'm like, oh. The, Would you also like to clarify another? I could finish my other point first okay. before the second. And that's and that's your right. Because uh, that is that is really good. <laughs> the other correction. Mm-hmm. Um, what were we talk? What was I talking about? Oh, I did the you tournament. Lost. Gen I, three. A Gen three. I weather lost. Team. It was weather team. It was bad. Ma, 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 ma. Uh, it was fine. I, I got. I was against someone. Uh, I believe he was cheating. No, he was Gen Nine, so he was Scarlet and Violet. Oh, I was thinking of the Gen One person who'd made some questionable decisions. Mm, I agree. The winner of the tournament, um, which good for them. They, Asterisk. They were smart. Like using the rules, you could use any Pokemon from your generation, or if your Pokemon evolved in a different generation, it still counts. You do have to use a starter, though. So this person for Gen 1 decided to make their starter Glaceon. See, that feels because dishonest. They, because they used Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee for the Eevee. And that feels dishonest. I but don't disagree. Listen, that, you, see a, you see a loophole and you jump. And I respect it, but it feels dishonest. Mm-hmm. And, I, and I got... I got um I found the source of the ticking. <laughs> oh, there's a ticking? It's that window. No, that's oh. that was a reference. Oh, okay. I found it. Is oh that window is the light? Yes. Oh. Weird. It doesn't seem like I guess maybe it is. It is. Oh. Right. Okay. Um I it would no, it was it was against Gen nine and uh there just wasn't a lot of like Gen three evolutions that I could use or like variants, regional variants or anything. I didn't really have a whole lot of options. So I just kind of went with it and winged it. Half my Pokemon didn't have items. They weren't holding anything. No focus sash. No. Nope. Uh, my Metagross, I completely forgot to like change its move so it still had tackle. Loves it. I forgot. Uh, I ran out of time. Love that. Because I, I wasn't doing it until was t- it was time to do it. Yeah. Um, that being said, first match, I knocked out one of his Pokemon. I love that. It was. Which Pokemon was it? I don't remember. Okay. It might have been a Farigaraf. Thank you. Maybe. I don't remember entirely. But I did get one. Oh, it might have been a Glamora, actually. Uh, and then he did pretty well. He actually did pretty well in the rest of the tournament. So I was like, good for you. It was just fun to be part of it. 
you know, to be involved. It was something that I was like, oh, this is a thing I've been working towards. And like, I survived the hospital. Great. And I'm like, I am in over my depths. Yeah. And, and, uh, there's no megas. If we were playing on showdown, I could have had megas. Yeah. And I could have terastalized, but I didn't want it to take longer. Yeah. Cause I was already losing. Like, I don't need to, I'm not going to make it last. <laughs> He's got me. Dura beat. last. No. Oh, uh, Dura stop. <laughs> that was an AFK arena joke for oh, my homies. Oh, we who know the lore. We don't have, you have been stopped. No, we only have. Oh, that is a real law. No off-topic question. That's an L on our part. I can't believe we have that. We really do. That's something that we have to make. We have to make a meeting. We need to do. Like, we got to take a day to just work on all this shit. And we got to have it written down. Yeah. <laughs> you ever watch a plan go wrong in real time? I just did. Yeah. 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 Me? No. No. Well, I, the plan was the first action I normally take, and like, there's nothing planned after that. So, not often. Sometimes, but things often don't go as expected. Do you ever think? Just sometimes, you ever just like play with the idea that like, it's not real. In what capacity? Like, life. Yeah. So like, reality's not real. Uh huh. Because like, it doesn't make sense. Uh, yeah, I do. I do. Like, a lot of times it's how I get around shit. Yeah. Like. Because, like. How does this relate to you dropping the mic on your phone? I don't know. Because <laughs> just, like, sometimes it's just, like, it doesn't feel real. <laughs> it's like the Grand Canyon in that way. <laughs> Are you trying to gaslight us? No. Now? Like, sometimes, like, the Grand Canyon doesn't look like it's real. Like, when you're there looking yeah, at no, it. it and doesn't. it doesn't look real. And then sometimes, like, it's, like. It's, just it's the realest uh, thing in the world. Yeah. I'm having waking up in a cold sweat going, the canyon. <laughs> like, this just doesn't make sense. There's got to be something beyond the canvas. Yeah. I get it. Like, sometimes it's like some things are like too good, and then so many other things are too suspiciously bad. And then, like, some things it's just like, this doesn't add up. <laughs> no, this is. <laughs> I mean, up. something's adding up to me right now. <laughs> I'm going to be really honest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they really have. And then sometimes it's like... This This brings me joy. Yeah. And sometimes it's like, I'm so tired all day. And then other times it's like, I Cut. did so much today. Yes. And then I'm like, but I wasn't tired today, even oh. though I did all day, all busy, busy. Some and then other days... I'm so tired. I don't want to get out of bed. Baby girl, let me tell you something. You are not. I don't think that we're meant to be always doing shit every day. I don't think we're always meant to be. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Just crumble. And it's wild. Sometimes I do wish I was turned into a chair. I've never wished that. Not often. Okay. Like once. But like I, like I could see the utility in like, what are you going to do if you're a chair? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You have to kill yourself when you become a chair. <laughs> Sorry, I'm alive. Just I'm trying it. to be better. Say it. I'm trying to be better. Say, I'm tired. Of, I'm <laughs> joking, bitch. <laughs> I'm tired. Where is it? I'm not joking, bitch. I'm tired of using stupid euphemisms. Mm -hmm. We can say things. I, you know, look, I'm not here trying to oopsie. <laughs> Yeah. But yeah. So, in, and speaking of like, sometimes things aren't real. Yeah. Um, sometimes they're just not. I mean, sometimes the sous vide chicken's too good. So, sometimes I'm st I'm I'm in that bag. <laughs> so cover me in pesto and stir me around at 145 sometimes degrees. I'm vacuum sealed, and you know what? Oh, fuck, I would be vacuum. I... Well, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Cut it out. Get us out of here. Decapitate that joke. <laughs> Gather the families. <laughs> no. I made the calculator show up again. <laughs> You're not even touching the keyboard. I did once. <laughs> did you go over and hit the calculator button? I think I hit it with my elbow. I don't care. That you, you hit, hit it with, with your, your elbow. elbow. <laughs> Speaking of things that aren't real. Yes. So there's a second correction fish or a clarification. Fish sticks aren't yes. real. But they are. 
Yeah. And I'm so grateful for that. You know, my sister once. <laughs> Speaking of fish sticks, <laughs> this is not a fun memory. I haven't eaten fish sticks in probably two years. Okay, work. I don't know if I've had. And I've before had that, fish fillets. And recently, before that, more recently than that, I would say that I hadn't had them in like six years. Work. So we're having a fish fry. <sighs> De- mm, no. Mm. My sister one time didn't want to eat her. Fish sticks, because she was vegan, vegetarian, or what have you. Right. Famously. And, yeah. And so, the story's not funny. Okay. And now that I think about it, I'm like, this is just kind of... Maybe it shouldn't be told. Yeah, but what I got to see was kind of funny. Because <laughs> <laughs> it didn't happen to me. Okay. Abuse... Well... well <laughs> oh, well. well. It's not abuse... Well... Well... Mm, it's one of those lines. Yeah. But, like, she tried to hide the fish sticks in her pants. So she had to do jump, jump a jacks. Like, it's not funny, but it is. Like, you got to understand me as a child <laughs> seeing this happen, going, this is not good. But also, I can't keep, I can't stop giggling. I won't name names. <laughs> Like a story could have been about anybody. <laughs> Literally anyone. If she heard me say that, she'd go, that was not funny. <laughs> and I know it's not. I'm, I'm sure it wasn't funny to her. And I, Yeah. But it was funny to me. And this is my show. Our show. The show. Hell yeah, podcast, the show. Hell <laughs> yeah, podcast, the show, the podcast. 24. Live. It's like 2K. 2K, 2K, 2-4. Hell yeah. So there was a correction. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> In, in and this this isn't so much as a correction as uh, something important for you as a viewer to know. So, it has recently come to my attention that the phrase "bricked up" <laughs> means that you 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 you're popping a boner, you're having an erection. An erection, yes. Let me. I'm gonna verify the purity of uh, the digital Merriam-Webster. Right. Which is. I almost said tshirthell.com, and that's not t-shirt. the website. Urban Dictionary. Just to make sure that I that I get this right, because I did not think that that's what bricked up meant. Um, bricked up is having an erection hard on yep. the Wiktionary. Yep. Uh, when your penis is fully erect, when your pee pee hard, pee pee. Uh, when the male genitalia says ao. Uh, when your male at- anatomy is hard, mm-hmm. to fly the sail at full mass. Okay, I have a boner. Mm-hmm. Is there anything else? Ooh, a new fast rising definition of bricked up. The phrase is being attempted to be reclaimed non-sexually. The new meaning is when something got you down in the dumps or something unfortunate <laughs> has occurred, <laughs> and the sentence says, "Damn, bro, my grandma's funeral got me bricked up." <laughs> I'm feeling a little bricked up. Bricked up. I have to think about reality. Bricked up. Meanwhile, you thought bricked up, man. I, I thought. <laughs> so is it better to explain how I first saw it or what I think it is? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so I had seen bricked up in a meme involving Legos. <laughs> and my takeaway from it was that bricked up meant constipated. <laughs> so... The entire time last episode, when Eric's laughing about how they're like, oh, we're, I'm bricked up. He's bricked up. I'm just thinking, yeah. We're going to keep you bricked up in this tunnel. Yeah, because he's like, he can't, well, come out. Right. <laughs> <laughs> like, I thought you were talking about him needing to poop the whole time. <laughs> I didn't know he had a boner. Mm-hmm. A train boner. A train boner. A loca boner. Meanwhile, but I, I don't, I, 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 I laugh I, uh, to laugh. Oh, we simply must laugh. To laugh. <laughs> but, um. Laugh. 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 Uh, but, um, meanwhile, yes. mere months ago, upwards of seven months ago, I purchased a t-shirt from the company that makes the horrid t-shirts that I wear on this, on this channel. Horrid from <laughs> Torrid. Only. Um. Yeah. Where it it said all bricked up on my way to Olive Garden, 
Uh huh. And then had a picture of like a piece of bread. Uh huh. When I purchased it, I thought, well, when I was purchasing it, I was around a youth, only slightly youther than us. Carrie? Yes. <laughs> Local youth, <laughs> local youths. It's him or Marshall, man. <laughs> yeah, only you s- wouldn't be. No, he wouldn't only, be. No, only slightly more youth than us. I believe three years youth of us, but it was enough. He's a little unyouth. Yeah. Um, oh. when I not not with his mustache. No, it's gone. Good. Yeah, it looked bad. I'm sorry. Bare faced, fresh faced. I don't faced. want. I don't want to be judgmental against facial hair, but now that I'm a woman, I can be. And that's tea. Thank you. Um. I misunderstood it to mean that because so this that company the 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 horrid t-shirt company also makes a variety of drug reference I was gonna say like a like like a Xanax or something I thought it was a, I thought exactly that I thought it was that you had like a brick of Xanax which thought, that that makes sense Right so that was what I thought and it's it, it's funny to me either way it works the idea of being like I need to take an entire brick of Xanax before I can make it at an <laughs> olive garden which I mean I just mean being fucked up at olive garden sounds like a fun time that part so, Pills are fun. So Don't it, take them. Ooh. Only things that are prescriptions. <laughs> so, it, 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 um, I, I love pills. <laughs> so, I take pills for the family. What's the twins? <laughs> so I thought it was that, and then Carrie uh-huh. was like, "No, no, no! It means like you've got like a boner." And I was like, "That's equally good. Young I man. will, I will still buy this T-shirt." So, well, I was good. you just a little bit ago. Yeah, you, you, when, nine days ago, in fact. <laughs> Nine days ago, I also was constipated. <laughs> well, like, and that's why I think because you wore that shirt on the podcast, didn't you? I probably did. I think so. It I, seems like if something I've seen I would it, wear on the podcast. Because my first thought when I heard like I'm bricked up at Olive Garden is like, <laughs> nice, because like you're about to eat a whole bunch of like cheesy pasta. That and also to, works. It's gonna make it a lot worse. You're gonna be con- like, you're fucked, man. I hated being constipated. Yeah, that's one of those where you get naked and sit on the toilet and you're sweating. You know those? Those kind of. Hey, look, everyone's hey, look. Everyone's. If you if you haven't had that moment yet, I hope I wish you the best when you do. Yeah, I and probably have. Some, well, it's like sometimes like you have enough time, you gotta like you gotta cool down. Well, it gets, it gets hot. It's over, which is crazy that like you're producing that much heat and you can't poop. <laughs> <laughs> Should be warming it up, just slide out. You'd think. You'd think, but it's bricked up. Perhaps it gets harder under the heat. It's kiln dried. <laughs> point of what i was trying to make was but what had happened was <laughs> mm, mm, i have it for you thank you yeah were you looking at the time yes oh we are getting a bit close famously famously i had my other thing but i think i'm gonna make a better bit about it well, actually no i can show you uh, okay. we have enough time you yes. have discord right and then we yes. can do packages and i think that'll be perfect yes so this I is i don't think i'm signed into that account on discord I could say, uh, well, I would have to doubt. I could show it to you on my phone because they can't see that. So, so I wanted to share with Eric a little bit of uh, something that I really enjoyed. My culture. Yes. So, um, I recently rewatched season two of, or the ending of season two of Jujutsu Kaisen. And at the very beginning of Metamorphosis, we have continued the Mahito and. Itadori fight. Uh oh. Uh huh. Right. That's not good. Okay. It didn't break. It didn't. It's LED. It can't. It can't. It's OLED. Um. So, uh, if you have seen Jujutsu Kaisen season two, or uh, don't want spoilers, if you don't want spoilers, then uh, this will be mild, tiny spoiler. Um, for a fight that happens. Well, I guess it's a big fight because it's like the third to last episode. But um, in particular, one of the greatest shots of this entire show, in my personal opinion, is in the, I want to say, it's it's the beginning of Metamorphosis, which is like the second or third phase of this fight against uh, this guy, Mahito, who can, he can change his shape at will, for lack of a better term, because he can mess with souls. It doesn't matter. Uji does a punch. His name's not Uji. It's Itadori. Itadori does a punch. And then he's super strong, and then his cursed energy is delayed. So it, like, you get hit, and then you get, like, an afterwave hit. Just so you know, Rick. Uh-huh. And then there's Toto, who uh, 
is he's big buff handsome man we love him and uh his his cursed ability is is very cool he uh we we discovered it in this season in this arc in the shibuya arc and uh uh he can clap he claps his hands and two things two objects switch places so the first phase of this fight had taken place in the subway system like because they bub- they did a giant bubble around Shibuya, the enemies did, the evil people. And they blocked everybody in, all these humans, and they transfigured them and shit. It's it's devastating. The, you know, the, the I'll have to report them to the cyber police. Consequences will never be the same. Mm-hmm. And um, so they, the, the fight with, like, all the fights of Mahito are, like, absolutely breakneck speed. Like, a bunch of shit is happening constantly. And they're just like reacting fight. It's very intense and like music and sounds and actions and shit. We it ends the episode, the episode just before they, they come out onto the blah, blah, blah to the, like the street and he explodes his human esque matter. Everything is nasty. And uh, there's like a quiet pause for a moment as they're like, everyone's catching their breath for a second. And Deep breath. Yeah. And it's like one of those where like shit's been really a lot of serious, insanely serious shit has happened up to this point. Um, that is not important for you to know, but like, in, in like, there is like like this incident has become the worst thing that has happened. Like it is, it is like the the gravity of like what is the fallout of this is insane. That being said, the pod, like the fight, they have this moment. Mahito yells some shit, which I did record, so you can have that part, mm-hmm. and. Uh, they, it's in anime specifically, um, a lot of like the more well-drawn shots or like super intense, if there's like a lot of color, a lot of action for like a big move, like, uh, Luffy recently did gear five. He did it again as well. And those gear five fights where he's super silly and bouncy, uh, from one piece are like really, really fucking well done and animated. Mm -hmm. Um, sometimes stuff's a bit sharper when it's animated. In particular, it is not often where I, I don't know what the term is, but like I want to use the phrase negative space, okay, or rather like uh, like limited movement. So as like they kind of all sit there and stop, Mahito yells some shit, and then the two guys. This is the audio transcript of, of what's going on. But there's this moment where uh, any time that there's a, a single shot um, where it doesn't really move, typically. They're just like taking the manga frames, mm-hmm. like uh, like the whatever the um, scene in the manga is, like that that drawing. They just kind of make it. Mm-hmm. Um, and I fucking love when like only one part of it is animated. And so in particular, it's this intense look on these two characters' faces, each each a shot, mm-hmm. where just like the pupil in their eye moves, like mm-hmm. as if they're looking at each other, which like already starts to give me chills because it's like. It's the like as a as a like as you're watching it, especially if you watch the previous episode, immediately watch the next one. The like intensity it slowed you down just enough to kind of be there with them, and uh, the one looks at the other. The up uh, they they both look at it kind of like the, each other, and it it zooms in on uh, Toto's hands, mm-hmm. and unlike having a locked camera, like fixed position camera. Mm-hmm. Uh, going in on the hands the camera is like a little wobbly as if you were like it's like that like oh fuck and it's this mm-hmm. quiet tense moment before the clap and then like the rest of the fight starts which i cut it off just before like he get he well mahito cuts his own head off and then the crab thing happens but you would not like seeing the crab so i didn't include the crab part okay because mm-hmm. you'd go oh what the fuck no thank you that sounds about right yeah i know you pretty well yeah you go much to your chagrin. Two sick dogs. I don't like that. I'd say I don't respond to that. That look, it floats. Don't like that. I don't like that. And so the reason that I show this is that if you, if you at home are interested in watching Jujutsu Kaisen, this is also a clip that I cannot find online. Mm-hmm. Like. If you were to search like make a the, YouTube short of it, the, I might, I might actually make a video talking about it a bit further. I don't know yet, but like shit is fucking nuts. It's the coolest part. It's better than any other clap that he does. And if you know the other ones that I'm talking about, like those are fucking sick. But this one in particular just fucking gets me of this like 
like the finality of like this is going to be the last break that we get in this fight that's been going on for like two episodes because mm-hmm. it's like the the Mahito guy is also a villain that's been around since relatively early in season one mm-hmm. so it's like a long time villain who's only gotten stronger and it's like can he just fucking die please yeah and and they're gonna beat some ass so here's uh some of this for you. I am prepared. Mm -hmm. Very over the top. Mm -hmm. My boy. It's very good. Yes. I in So I was curious if you yourself in maybe like something to like get back to me like next week on uh-huh. is like do you have like in in like Star Trek or whatever like is there or what some some a media that you have consumed it could be a game as well where like yes. there's like that shot mm-hmm. that like just gets you fucking like cranked. Yeah. I'd have to think because that was kind of more of like the core of what I wanted to share mm-hmm. about it. Because I'm like, it doesn't fully make a whole lot of sense. And like, it's very silly. I also am skipping the entire fantasy part mm-hmm. in the middle. Of, well, Toto is in love with idols. A specific, a specific idol who he, in his head, is like, like, there. He got rejected in his own daydream. But Uji was there. Sorry. Itadori is there. Mm-hmm. Ichi, or whatever his name is. Ichi. Yeah. Uh, Itadori when they first met their friends mm-hmm. about the ass stuff so uh, I wanted to know when you it, it take some time think about it and let me know because I'd love to see it because that shit tight as hell yeah and uh, if, if you're at home go watch that scene again and think about how cool it is but uh, big thing is that like a lot of times when I'm watching stuff like I I, I actually try to like I try to break th- out of the fourth wall Mm -hmm. like i try to actually put myself like in their shoes like oh fuck okay like if like this guy's gonna fucking kill us like they have to you ever think about in a fight where it's like this guy could kill you if you fuck up one time yeah and it's like i couldn't do that but i could pretend to do that through them yeah yeah it's pretty cool yeah i sometimes think about like video games and stuff from the perspective of like halo for example they're they're elites that you know Sangiri or Sangili Sangili yeah like war heroes they've survived so long so strong so well so very strong and powerful mm-hmm. and then it's just like overcharged plasma shot single pistol shot to the like head. that was a decorated warrior gone just fucking the poof life isn't real to go Sometimes back to your reality. things aren't real. But the, see, at the inverse to that, though, or like the, the, the corollary as well, in my opinion, is that's why sometimes it's fun to think things that aren't real to like pretend they're real mm-hmm. because like you could get something pretty cool out of it. Like I famously in Halo have killed enemies. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And like you can just come up. Eric behind, admits to a crime. One point. You can just come up behind an enemy, and just whack them, and then they're just gone, and they never knew you were there. And so it's like they lived an entire life as a little baby, and then as a child, and then as a young adult. They have it depends on the species of how old mm-hmm. they were before they were conscripted into the war effort. Then by the covenant. And they've made it this whole time. And then all of a sudden, they're just, they're just literally like looking at their friend and they're just like, he's sleeping. And then mm. they're sleeping. <laughs> Lights God. out. And they never knew. Like some of them, like, see Chief, like, you know, uh-huh. which is me. Yeah, you're Chief. They see me, Chief, <laughs> across the bridge and they go, <gasps> and then, and then it's lights out. Well, because then they can, but like, they, they can fight. Me. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, no, it's time. Like, they know who. Because, like, you're basically John Wick. 
in a lot of ways. You're Baba Yaga, like uh, Master Chief is. Yeah. Where like the Covenant are like, if it, there's the Master Chief, like that's like the devil. They call right. them the, the demon. The, the demon. The demon is here. But it's literally like you're you're like the one person they're all afraid of, this, or like they need to kill. This Master Chief, this demon. Demon. It's cool for a human to be called a demon. He's a demon. It's a yeah. demon, Joffrey. Yeah. Uh, how, like, and poof. You want, uh, do you think about that like ever like in the middle of gameplay sometimes where you're just like... When I'm tiptoeing the delicate line of an existential crisis and I'm mm. thinking too much about death and then I start to personify that into the game that I'm playing in an effort to like get my head out of it but then somehow it goes, hey, you want to think cute. about dying again? And I'm like... I've I'd rather. Too. I'm like I'd rather not, but I really don't get much of a say in it, huh? And it goes, yeah. <laughs> it goes. Um, that is correct. <laughs> and then no, poof. you don't. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry you have to deal with that sometimes. It's fine. It's part of living. Yeah, and I mean that's a better way to do it. It's it's just thinking about. All that kind of stuff. Listen, like, you just got to have fun with it. I've had fun before. You just got to go. Sometimes I am the young boy. Mm-hmm. And sometimes when I'm I was a brave young boy. You understand. Package time? Uh, pat, pat, pat. Package, Package time. time. With the boys. Ow. Ow. I mean, that's why I love quick, quick, quick. Half the time, <laughs> the best part about the jingle was us trying to remember which, which jingle is which. Which one's which? Which, which. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Part of it. So it looks like we have a letter. Like we, have we have two. We just got a letter. We just, we just got, got a letter. We, we just got, got a letter. I wonder where it's from. Can't tell because I blacked it out. Correct. <laughs> Are they from the? Uh, they might be from the. Same I believe person. they're from the same person. Yeah, which I. They're both from. I don't know if I can say that, but they mentioned it. Okay. No one can hear me. No one can hear you. <laughs> Peace. Pee pee. Ooh, how very cute. Thank you. Okay. Uh, if only I had a little ho- a little holder that fit. We don't do that. My big rod. We don't do that. Um. Oh, okay. It's a gift certificate to Applebee's. It's not. <laughs> I wish it was. <laughs> Cause we can't. Cause we can't we go. We can't go to Denny's. Denny's. Guys, sometimes sad is a fad. The the analysis failed the, our Denny's. The psychoanalysis I want to have on the, on the failed Denny's project. Yeah. <laughs> the breakdown of of what really what happened. Well, what had happened was had we happened? stopped going. That part. And it turns out that we were a larger percentage of their consumer base than they probably would have wanted. Us yeah. To be. Yeah. Right. Uh. I have more sticker paper than I know what to do with, so have some hand-drawn Pokemon stickers. Oh, I love that. Sorry if they're a little messy. Sticker paper is a bit weird to draw and color on. Kind of. I'm sure it is, but I'm sure you also did an excellent job. Yes. This one is for you. <gasps> a little Jigglypuff, it's which Jiggles. is very, very cute. It's I love Jiggles. him. He's got a secret. It's the Jiggles. Oh, this Jigglypuff I knows things. I got a good little Scraggy. Thank you so much. Very it's handsome cool. little man. Tinko, tinko. Has little legs. Yeah, he's a little pants lizard. That Jigglypuff is up to something. That Jigglypuff knows like something. Hmm? That Jigglypuff's like... That Jigglypuff knows a move that's illegal in oh. in, uh, in VGC. <laughs> Isn't there a bit that we have or a reference where something's like... It's like a... <laughs> don't we have one of those? Turn and smile? Yeah, that seems like something we would have. The, what's a, Can we, like... What do we have under the tag? Mischievous? <laughs> I wish we could have our references in a way that was easier to access. I wish I could search my brain. If I could control F my brain, it would be over for control you. Control F my brain. <laughs> it's a bubble maker. Ooh. Oh. It's heavy. Oh, mailer heavy. Use your fingers. I'm trying. Use them better. I'm learning. Rip it. Let's hit it 
let the past rip. Rip it if you have to. Let it rip. <laughs> let it roll bowl. Let it ro- oh, what's that from? That was a bowling alley. Strike. <laughs> Twinky. <laughs> Fish sticks. <laughs> you understand? Why did you say fish sticks earlier? I need to know. You're finally understanding. <laughs> it was just the first thing that came to your mind, wasn't it? Cunt. <laughs> oh, what's in the package? Oh! Doesn't look like there's any soda in here. <laughs> All right, I got a letter. He. <laughs> Uh, okay, I can read it. Okay. Because I read it. Okay. I read it, so I read it. Oh. Hey, Hype. What up? You're not talking to me. Been a while. I'm, ta- I'm talking to you. I was about to go, not much. Oh. Uh, what up, girl? It's time for fun activities. Which means it's time to almost wrap up the show. Uh, been a while since I sent y'all something, so oh, I'm wow. giving you some jewelry I made. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah. There's four pairs of earrings in the box, and okay. you can decide who gets what. Oh, they don't clarify who you is. Oh, <laughs> so hmm. you is hype. We well hype. You of hype. You of hype. You of hype. Yo, graduate. That's our Patreon. You <laughs> of hype. You of hype. Would you like to uh, Gra- apply for you of hype? hype. <laughs> Unaccredited. We have very comprehensive degree programs. Unaccredited. Piss throw dynamics. Piss. Yeah. We actually have a really good animal husbandry program. I love that. Not to be confused with clown husbandry. Or hogs. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, clown husbandry. It is an internet thing. Well, I just divorce him. I think it was a Tumblr thing. That's good, though. I found out about it from YouTube, though. Mm-hmm. So it probably was Tumblr. Probably. Most good things Seems like something Tumblr. Sarah Zed would talk about. Correct, yeah. It seems like a strange Eons video. Right. Right. It, I think like it may it have was, been. Yeah. I don't I don't often watch uh their stuff, but it comes up in my recommended and then I don't watch. But mm-hmm. I go that some would probably be good. fun to watch. Some some, some of their stuff. And then very, very occasionally I do. When you do, I'm glad. And then I take it out of my, my search history. I Not understand. search history. My watch history. Because mm-hmm. I'm like don't keep recommending these. Don't. But I also, they look good, so so that's why you should stop yeah. recommending them. Well, also, like it's it is the type of content you would watch. I like, know, and I feel like I can't go down that rabbit hole. I, it's my classic conundrum of I can't watch media because I'll like it. Yeah, no, no, I I totally get it. I totally understand. Yeah, there's some YouTubers where I'm like, I haven't watched you in forever. I should unsubscribe. Sometimes I have, and it's also like, ooh, there's some that I'm not going to subscribe because I don't. Yes, I do like it, but I'm two videos behind, so I'm just gonna give up. I, I missed I missed an upload. The soul deep okay. way in which I understand that. Sometimes it really be just I well, I missed my, one. It is my Kokoro YouTube channel subscription experience. <sighs> your yeah. Your you your your Kokoro subscription. Yes. Is one that just I wish I wish I wish as a creator I could unsub you. You you know, like you yeah. could be like, you know, someone makes a comment, you're like, you know what? I'm unsubscribing you from my channel. Right. You don't need to be here. <laughs> Get out of here. Get leave. out of here. Pick and choose. Uh, if the earrings aren't either of your styles, feel free to re-gift them to someone else. A smiley face. Ooh, oh. We have it out. <laughs> I love to hear it. Love to see it. Hope you like them and keep up the great work. Heart. P.S. Bonus drawings. Kenna. Thank you. Cool. Work. Also, while you unpackage that and while I'm thinking of it because we were talking about YouTube, if, if you are a person who either doesn't has has not historically liked thomas the tank engine but like thinks that the insanity of it is funny conceptually Mm -hmm. um or if you are an adult person who liked thomas the tank engine as a child when you were a trifle wild wild. and your spirits just ran away with you um and now would like a a way to experience it in a form but as an adult where it's like funny haha um there's a channel called trampy uh where he has like trampy movie and he has like 15 parts of it or something so far. And it's like, not like adult in like like a sexual adult way, but more of like an adult audience oriented look and sort of like very actually interesting retelling 
of like early Thomas the Tank Engine stuff in a way where like he reorders some of the stories and everything and like tells like slightly different stories and also like it's funny because like the trains like say sometimes they'll say things like shit like adult humor you mean yeah yeah like it's it's not it's not just like we re-edited the kids clips yes and it's and not it's not a shabooty dub no and it's not like crass per se but it's just funny it's thought provoking and poignant. Well, it has crass moments, but when I say, uh, but does like, it have a total clap moment for you? It does not. Ah, uh, so but he doesn't work on his camera angles. No, he just takes like still clips from all the episodes, and just like reorders them. But it's funny, and it's a funny way to uh, to re-experience Thomas the Tank Engine. So if that's your vibe, check out Trampy. Free plug. You heard it here. You heard it here. We don't have all any of our tools. You're fighting for your life over there. Hey, hey, I stopped biting the packages, all right? And I appreciate that. I'm a lady. Ladies don't bite. Boop. Unless the check clears. Well, my mouth was small. Yeah. I don't mean to bite. <laughs> uh, here's the earring. Oh. Okay, well. We're going to have to see what these look like on feet. What we... Oh, we got to see what they look like, what they look like on feet on here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's fun. And then there's, and that's fun. I'm not fully certain what they all look like, but they look pretty great. I believe you. this is like loops of chains loops hanging of down. Chains. Ooh, that's very that. you energy. T. Very cool. Very well, thank you thing. so much. Yeah. That's very kind of you. Hell yeah. And then two drawings for oh. us as well. And Rob. That was right. very thoughtful oh. of you. Is it? Yes, it is. Hell yeah. So they had made these more <laughs> recently. Oh. They also updated uh, one of the pictures from that they had sent to us uh, a couple of years ago. Okay. Um, I think I know the one. Where it's like you and me. Yes. And it's like kind of space. Yes, because I kind of saw that art style. So yes. I, I remember. Yeah, they, they updated it oh. uh, so that my uh, I look a bit more uh apropos to now of course which is very nice so thank you that's but good. uh yeah we have this one nice and yours <gasps> he's me your little man oh thank a little you little handsome boy oh that's so sweet mm -hmm. oh thank you oh and they got the, your lock and chain they right. did get my lock and chain thank you thank you i appreciate that and thank you that's very well done thank you i can't wait to thank you much oh this is during my choker phase loves it work i bought another choker but it's like one of those ones where my neck too fat or thick, so like yeah. it don't. It like it I could do, do it on the last one, the but I'm like, mm. yeah. And it's like we can get an extender, and I'm like, I don't want to give up. Mood though. And it's like I like yeah, I could just like buy another one that's like larger. Uh huh. But I already bought one. <laughs> yes. You understand. I understand. Thank you. This is very kind of you. Thank you. Thank and you, you are a very talented artist. Yeah, and it feels really nice too on the good the paper. Out. Yeah, good I can't, paper. I can't even feel the the paint. <laughs> oh, I see it from behind. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can. I can, see, <laughs> I can see through the paper a little bit. <laughs> see it from behind. <laughs> when like, I close my eyes, I can't see. <laughs> I'm over here like, wow! <laughs> Look at that. Kind of look, look at the work you did. God <laughs> damn! See it from the back. <laughs> I can see it from the back. <laughs> oh my oh goodness! My so does that mean? So when are we doing f French Fry Friday? Friday. You want to do that this Friday? Sure. I was gonna do Life is Strange. Oh, that's sad. I can do that Saturday. Well, or do you want to do it? Life Saturday? is Saturday. Well, are you busy Saturday? I'm busy Saturday. Yeah, I knew you would be. Yeah. Are you busy Friday? Yeah, doing French Fry, Fry Friday. French Fry Friday. Thank you. We have to actually like, we we'll have to do a little bit of planning. Yeah. Beforehand. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we should. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because we gotta have waffle fries. Thank you. Uh, well, McDonald's fries, which win? Of course. What? Uh, yeah, I mean. Oh, you said win. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Statistically speaking, it's they're most likely to win. Thank you. Then. We gotta have Chick Fil A waffle fries. Yeah. We gotta have Jack in the Box fries. Both Curly kinds. Fries. Oh, ooh, we get yeah, halves. We gotta try both kinds. Cause mm -hmm. we, cause we already agreed that there were two separate categories: curly fries and regular mm -hmm. fries. But we need to like, we need to do them all. Uh huh. Does that mean we gotta hit Arby's too? Yep. 
<sighs> we got to do, for, for curly fries, we got to do Arby's and Jack in the Box. Mm-hmm. Are there any others? Green Bay. Love that. Yeah. Love that. Right. Rallies. Uh, do they do curly fries? We can go to Checkers. I think it's a Rallies. I don't know where the nearest Rallies is. Near. Great. <laughs> Great. I love Rallies. Yeah. Near you. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, right. 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 So. McNaldo's. McNaldo's. Bubker Kink. <sighs> Those Shut are going to be low tier. <laughs> Jack of the Box. Yeah. Chick-fil-A. Mm-hmm. Wendy's. In and out. Wendy's. It, in and out. In and out's going to be divided. Yeah, you want to you want to talk low tier. You want to talk low T. Wendy's is is mid. If yes, and that's being generous. T. Who else? Um, Popeyes has fries that are seasoned like curly fries, but they're straight. Where does that live? It's the bisexual French in fry. the closet. Okay, love that. Loves it. Um. <laughs> Why would you even ask? Uh, who else makes fries? Uh, Del Taco. Oh, Del Taco. There's a lot of places to get fries. How do we, do we just get it all and then eat it? I feel like we can't. No. I it's got to be like the Wiener Weekend where we eat in the moment. Yes, we'll have to, we'll do it in the car, but we'll actually have like criteria so that we have like, it's an organized <laughs> thing. And then we could like, at the same time, it's like, oh, okay, yeah, we'll give it this. We'll Mouth give it that. Feel. Salt. Yeah. Uh, uh, Fish sticks. Uh, uh. Uh, what's the word? Um, how how do they uh, like? What is the? I don't know how to describe it, but like I don't know what the word is. But like, how easy are they to consume? How many do they give you? Because I'm gonna come out and say it. I do like Burger King fries, but I don't appreciate that you're given four of them. Four big fat steak boys. And that's it. Steak fries. Oh. There aren't any fast food places that do steak fries. Mm. Red Robin. Right. Red Robin counts. Right. Yeah. We could get Red Robin to go. We'll get a pizza. I don't. <laughs> we'll get a pizza and the french fries. Oh, God, no. But I didn't know we were skiing. <laughs> we're going to get a Donato's pizza. We're we getting Donato's pizza for the boys. We're going to get Donato's pizza and french fries. They got the little scoops to go. The little to go. I don't want to take it to go. We're here to pick up an order to go. <laughs> I feel like they're going to kick our ass. Of a Donato's pizza? A Donato's pizza They better deny us that pizza. If they were ever going to have a to-go order, wouldn't it be a pizza? (laughs) (laughs) If a Red Robin had a to-go order in the woods, would anyone be around to collect their Donato's pizza? You know who used to have seasoned fries and regular fries? Don't. Danny's? Danny's. Danny's. Danny's had it. Denny's or Burger system. Hut or whatever that like fake storefront they made was. Oh, oh yeah, oh the <laughs> their the, like delivery. Yeah, which is just their own burger. Burger Bonanza Shop, something like that. The one of the ghost kitchens. Yep. Mm. Who else has French fries? Rest in peace, the Denny's. We didn't save it. Portillo's. <laughs> Sorry, that's why we can't have a Patreon because we don't follow through. <laughs> we couldn't save a Denny's. <laughs> On top ten, Miss Mojo's hype betrayals, the failure hype of saving failures. The Denny's. hype failures. <laughs> You know, the boys, they could never save the Denny's. Yeah. They didn't. Although, to be honest. Do you think mm-hmm. that lady who does most of the Miss Mojos, do you think she has a cameo? And do you think we could pay her to do, like, to record lines for a top 10 hype video that will do the editing and everything to make it look like a Miss Mojo? Yeah. But do you think we could pay her? Because like, I need her voice. Yeah. Specifically. And I'm not going to use AI tools because that's inappropriate. Correct. She might. She deserves to be paid for her voice. If work. anyone knows, we'll have to look it up. I'm going to find it. If only her. we had a Jamie to pull that shit up. Hi, man. Look it up. No. <laughs> I'm going to tell them you said that. Oh, you mean that? Oh, 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 okay. That was very funny. I did also, not mean for that to no, be funny. Uh, no, it wasn't. It was how funny apro- to me. How apropos. But uh, yeah, I've been joking about it. Got it. Because like I've been streaming, right? And since right there, right. So half the time, but it is nice because I'm like I'm talking to chat. I'm like I'm not getting anything from chat. So I just like I'm like, hey, shout out to the crowd. Yeah, <laughs> in the crowd. Yeah, work. They can, they can see it more. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right, right, right. Who else has French fries? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot we were talking about French fries. Um, Canes. Five guys. Oh, Canes. Canes and Culvers. 
Canes and Culver's, they got the same. They got that crinkle fry bullshit, Ooh. nasty, nasty, ugh, yeah. ugh, ugh, pee in my mouth. This is so many fries. But if that's all we're getting is that's fries, all we're, getting. we're not having to eat a bunch of little wieners. No, we're just getting a small fry at each of these places. Oh, perfect. Literally just enough to wet the whistle. Mm-hmm. And then we'll have to have like And napkins. a Diet Coke at Can every we... single place. And a blue Powerade. I was, there we go. The blue Powerade. Jimmy John's doesn't have french fries. They uh, have thinny chips. <laughs> Grow up. <laughs> Who else has I want a Slim fries? Five. Yes. That sounds delicious. Who else has french fries? I literally had a Slim Five with extra Vito for lunch, and it was fucking amazing. Oh, I'm envious. Uh, I had Adderall for lunch. I love that. I don't. Who else has french fries? I'm trying to think of what a burger. What a burger would have a fry. They have French fries. Mm-hmm. Carl's Gunier. <laughs> <laughs> they got fries. <laughs> Is that what we go out on? <laughs> Carl's Gunier. <laughs> I think. I think we're good. <laughs> I can't wait to go to Carl's Gooner. <laughs> I prefer green burrito. <laughs> I, I don't know if we can go out on that, but that's good. Okay. I don't know. There's fry places. Fries? Where? Oh. At fries? Frozen fries. No. No. Um. Yeah, we said Del Taco. Yeah. yeah. Carl's Gooner. <laughs> Carl's Gooner. Oh, can I get Star's Nuggets if we go there? What is that? You've never had Star Nuggets from Carl's Gooner? When I go to Carl's Gooner, what, Gooner? I'm, what I'm getting Gunois. is a, a bespoke <laughs> Monster <laughs> Angus Thick Burger. Mm-hmm. So you can get their chicken stars. They have the little, you know, the little face on the star. I'm tired. No, you want chicken stars. I'm so tired. Daddy, I want chicken stars. I'm so, so hungry. I want small fries. Take me to Gunois. <laughs> We're going to make a list. I don't care. We're taking... It's Friday, and we're mm-hmm. going to many establishments. We're going to be very busy on Friday. We're going to get a lot of fr- We're going to map it out. Okay. That, yeah, we need to. We're going to map it out. We could have an evening. <laughs> an evening of fries? Oh. Yeah. Carbo load this Friday? Work. I mean, you guys may not get it till. You won't get it Friday. You can oh, have, oh yeah, because we have to. We will have to splice it. They can have it Monday. Yeah, you guys get to wait. Because then the couch cast isn't over because it's not the fourth couch cast episode. Right. It's live in the field. Well, see that could be. And it buys us time. Well, it could also be a a secondary, like Wiener Weekend. It was like you know some feet on the street. Yeah. So it's like it's one of our. It it goes in a different playlist. It's so a hype adventure. We get we get still podcast as well. No talking, only fries. We'd have to do it like YouTube. We could be food theory. That's SciShow. Yeah. I don't know. Right. Right. I keep getting recommended on Instagram the the red jacket that Matt Pat would wear. Okay. Okay. I have a red leather jacket. Okay, is it the, like the one that Matt Pat wears? It's a red leather jacket, but I don't think it's like his. Mm. But it is red, and it's, I mean, it's fake leather. Fox. It's fox leather. Foxy. Okay, I think I'm good. Yeah, we're good. Carl's Gunier was really, <laughs> really fucking good. I think that really was the high. I want chicken stars at Carl's Gunier. Okay, I'm gonna, we're going <laughs> to go now. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Tell three friends about the podcast and sound off in the trough below, you little content-loving hog, rolling around in the pig pen, clamoring for more slop.